All right, let's talk about the concept of yin and yang. So this is a concept that goes back thousands of years in ancient Chinese culture. To sum it up, it's basically the concept of duality. There is not one without the other. For example, there is no good without evil. There is no light without dark. There is no happiness without sadness. And the list goes on and on. You can also interpret this concept however you want. But let's get a little deeper. There is no such thing as something or somebody being yin or yang. Everything is yin and yang. Everything has an opposite, but if you think about it more, it's not really an opposite. That other half makes that thing what it is. Are y'all getting what I'm saying? Let me give y'all an example. Check out this list. Yin is feminine. Yang is masculine. Yin is a negative charge. Yang is a positive charge. Yin is the nighttime. Yang is the daytime. Yin is fall and winter. Yang is summer and spring. Yin is wet. Yang is dry. Yin is death. Yang is life. I ran out of time, so make sure y'all like and follow for more.